Welcome back to Coffee Time. I'm Donna. And I'm Denise. <laughs> and today we're going to be talking about entrepreneurs. Mm. So we're going to be talking about a young lady that I interviewed. And her name is? Her name is Katrina Howell. Oh. <laughs> yes. Yeah, and she's amazing because she's not only just a businesswoman out there doing her thing, she's a single mom, mm -hmm. she's an actress, mm -hmm. she's a model, she's a lot. <laughs> <laughs> What's you're about to see after Donna tells us a little highlights of everything, mm -hmm. you'll see where this young lady has really just kept going, kept going. Mm -hmm. So tell us a little highlights about it. Well, I mean, you know, when you watch the show, you're going to be pretty amazed. But I do have to say this. She is very inspirational. She mm -hmm. is out there really doing a lot. And she just keeps, like you say, she keeps moving. She keeps going. And I'm very proud of her, and I'm sure when folks look at it, they'll be like, wow, she will be motivating. Really? Yeah. <laughs> so how was your week? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, it was really good. It was relaxing and everything. You um, love the weather? I love the weather. It is so yes. beautiful here in North Carolina. So. Yes. And everything. Oh, yeah. We got to do shout outs because remember the last time we did shout outs, people loved it. So okay. I want to okay. shout out to Oklahoma because those people have been holding it down. <laughs> and, I, <Oklahoma. laughs> and I also would like to shout out to um, the night crew of Store 5013. They know who they are. <laughs> I want to shout out to 155. They know who they are too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And Long Island and New York and Philadelphia and Florida and come on, keep up with me. Keep up with me. Atlanta, Hotlanta. Ooh, yes. Hotlanta. Mm -hmm. uh, California. Mm -hmm. Arizona. Did I say Arizona? I think I said Arizona. Okay. No, 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 no. Okay, go ahead. Arizona. Arizona. <laughs> yes. And don't say I didn't say hey nothing. <laughs> I said it. Mm -hmm. oh, so, but yeah, we did our shout outs and everything. I had to throw that in there, folks. And it <laughs> well, since we did our shout outs, we said, how you doing? How was your weekend? And you cut us off and I'm so happy for that. So <laughs> if we don't get it in the next two minutes, it ain't going to happen. Two seconds, it ain't going to happen. Okay. <laughs> so I've been drinking a lot of water. I got my little water container, you know. I'm just letting y'all know that I've been keeping up with it. Mm -hmm. And I want you guys to come back. Come back. Mm -hmm. We'll be back in a couple of seconds. Mm -hmm. Welcome, and guess what? I'm here with my girl, Katrina Howell. I'm so excited. I know. <laughs> And Katrina has so much to tell us today. But before we start, I kind of want to introduce you. <laughs> How I know Katrina is I played her mama in a move indep independent movie, Sexy Assassin. You did? Yeah. You were my mama that girl. She, oh, she mama. shot them good. Mm. She shot that girl and was protecting her family. <laughs> she pulled a mama move. A mama move. A mama move. <laughs> So, for those who don't know Katrina, because my God, I put a post on Facebook and like all of a sudden people out of the woodwork were like, oh my God. But those who don't know you, can you kind of explain a little bit about yourself? Um, well, I'm an actress. I've mm -hmm. been acting since I was 25. Yeah, I'm late. Yeah. I'm late. <laughs> And I thought you were going to say like seven or no. something like that. She was like 25. I was so camera shy when I was a kid. I swear. <laughs> like, it was horrible. I'm like, don't take pictures of me. Don't say anything to me with no cameras. I was so camera shy. Really? And I just realized one day after I did a video for Evan Gibson. Mm -hmm. You know Evan, right? Evan. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I was in his um, monumental video. And from then, I just realized I wasn't as camera shy as I thought I was. And wow. that's how it started. Wow. Yeah. So... You went from camera shy to all of a sudden up in everybody's independent. Everybody's. <laughs> <laughs> so, like, tell me something. What type of parts did you play, or whatever? Um, lately, I've just been, I've been, I've been kind of violent lately. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I, know. I, I done killed a lot of my friends over the past two years or so. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> Those who are just tuning in, she means she's an actress. Oh, and yeah. She, yeah she's, she's Don't not, quote she, me on that. She, yeah, she's not off killing off her friends. Just in the movies, I'm <laughs> killing off movement. my friends. Because I really want, my, my main goal is, is action films. Mm -hmm. I love action films. 
and I got it. I definitely got it. Mm -hmm. But um, I'm really, I'm really wanting to do like a romantic comedy because I think that people forget that I'm still a woman. <laughs> <laughs> and then it's like Katrina's always shooting somebody. That's why you're happy. You're shooting someone. Mm -hmm. But you know, I, I wanna. I feel like I'm very diverse, and mm -hmm. I can play all types of roles. Mm -hmm. I commit myself, and I try to make it as good as possible, as believable as possible. Wow. So I, 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 I think I have a little um, you diversity. Know, you got a little love bug up in you. Yeah, I got some love bug. <laughs> I can smile and be cute. You know, not just bang bang. Let me kill you real quick and walk away. <laughs> Well, out of those those movies, I do have to ask, like, what was, like, your favorite role that you played? My favorite role? How this... There's been a lot of different roles. I can't even think right now. Oh, wow. <laughs> I know I loved you in Sexy Assassin because you was like, you was beast. All I have to say, <laughs> she was beast. She didn't play no jokes. And like, if somebody pissed her off, she was oh, like, look, man. I'm going to have to get you and I'm going to get you good. Yeah, it so, was bad how the guy died in the truck. Ooh. 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 So that means you have to see it because it was bad. Yeah, you have to see it. <laughs> <laughs> but honestly, um, my favorite role, I think, is the role that I'm currently doing five rounds. Okay. It's 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 deep. It's diverse. Mm -hmm. um, the character displays many different types of emotions. The movie is very deep. It's relatable. Mm -hmm. Relatable to me. Mm -hmm. As I read the script, I was like, oh my god, I I, I completely understand what this woman is going through. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was really relatable, and um, that's why I wanted it so bad. It's challenging. Mm -hmm. It's actually the most challenging role that I've ever done, because I have to cry. Mm -hmm. That's something that's really hard for me to do in front of people. It's the oh, it's the cry because it's, it's so hard. Because <laughs> you know I don't I don't like to feel that vulnerable. Mm -hmm. And being that I had to cry in front of a lot of people, a mm -hmm. room full of you know cast and crew, it was really difficult for me. Mm -hmm. Well, can I ask you this? Because you just said that it's hard for you to cry. Do, do any of your roles are they anything like your personal character, or is it just completely <laughs> different? Yeah. No, there is a lot of me in a lot of these characters. Mm -hmm. You know, um, I'm a Gemini. Uh oh, <laughs> Gemini, y'all. <laughs> there was a lot of me in me, and that's why I feel like I relate to so many different characters to how I can transform into all these different people. It's because mm -hmm. a lot of the time, I'm I'm those those characters. Oh wow! And it's it's really not that it's easy, mm -hmm. but I just I, I embody a lot of them because mm. there's there's a lot of me in here. <laughs> <laughs> Not to sound crazy. <laughs> okay, so when we come back, we're going to talk a little bit more about you. We're actually going to, I like to touch a little bit about how, you know, like your, your home life and, you know, oh getting into that. <laughs> and she does a little bit. She's got a little entrepreneurship up in her too. Oh, got so, to. Yeah, we're going to talk a little it. bit about that too. Yeah. <laughs> 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 and um, before we go, I know that you said you was going to make something, so I'm so excited about that. I did make you something today. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Stay it tuned. It has something to do with the entrepreneurship. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> we, we are so stupid. <laughs> hey. <laughs> well, that's awesome. Mm -hmm. She started at the age of what? 25 years old so she was shy believe it or not mm -hmm. you would you wouldn't know that with the movies that she plays in no <laughs> especially in sexy assassin mm. she plays girl these. like you act like she got it on <laughs> yeah she's like she's pretty amazing because she got out there she's fierce you know, mm -hmm. you you look at her show, you're like, oh my gosh, you know. Mm -hmm. And then for her to say, oh, I was shy, and I didn't start until I was 25. Blew I was, me away. Yeah. Blew yeah. me away. <laughs> but you but know. But you played her mama. That's right. Mm -hmm. Yes, she did. <laughs> she played her. You don't look like her mama. Look like her older sister, maybe. <laughs> Thank you, mama. Yes. 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 yes, yes. And she's doing a lot of murder and mayhem movies. Yeah, she, yeah, yeah. So those are the parts she's playing, but she also, you know, she mentioned she wants to get into some romantic. So I could see her in a, a romantic movie, you know. Yeah, well, a romantic <laughs> comedy. Yeah, yeah, I could see yeah. her doing something like playing that. Playing the straight. 
you know, and it'd be real funny if mm -hmm. she could do that. And then she whips out a gun. <laughs> <laughs> Just don't. <laughs> what other movies was she in besides the um, Aubrey's Do you remember? Um, she's, of course, she was in Sexy Assassin. Yeah. And um, she she actually tells about a couple of the movies that she was in, and I think she was in um, uh, five, uh, five Round or Five. You know what? I said Sexy uh, um, Outbreak Zero. We have so many people that have been coming on here. About Outbreak Zero. I didn't want to say nothing. I was like, yeah. okay. Well, <laughs> our producer would have found it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Well, she was in, in what, was, what did you say it was? Um, she was in Five Rounds, which is a movie that is getting ready to come out. And then she's in a couple of more um, that she mentions during the show as well. Really? Mm -hmm. Really? I could <laughs> see her doing certain movies. Yeah. Yeah. And she's, and you know, she's very pretty too. Mm -hmm. And so I could see her further in her career and modeling too, you know. Mm -hmm. She's on my Facebook. Oh, really? Yeah. And <laughs> she's got all those pictures on there. I said, you go, baby. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Listen. Mm -hmm. When we come back, we're going to talk some more. She's going to tell us about her business. Yeah, she's also an entrepreneur as well. So I tell you, sister girl got it going on. <laughs> yes, she does. Talk to you guys in a minute. So you said you was into movies and modeling yeah. and all entrepreneur, all of that. So go ahead, talk, talk. Yeah, the floor. <laughs> okay. Well, um, the modeling didn't start until about a year after I started acting. Because when I was a kid, um, I used to babysit. Mm -hmm. And when I was about 15, I used to babysit for this lady. And she was an ex-model. And I guess she saw something that I didn't see. Because I was skinny and kind of awkwardish and blemishes and bumps. And I was just like, uh, no. I'm not <laughs> getting to put it on my camera. You know? <laughs> so she ended up convincing me to do it. But I was just so shy. It just mm -hmm. didn't look natural. So I let it go. And she let it go as well. Mm -hmm. So um, I decided to give modeling another shot. Mm -hmm. And hey, you know, it worked well, out. Well, it's good because you're yeah. very beautiful and your pictures are like gorgeous. <laughs> I, been, I was like, oh my gosh, she she takes really, really <laughs> good pictures. So I'm glad Thank that you, you went into modeling. I'm sure everybody out there too. <laughs> it's fun because I get to um, embrace my, my inner Gemini <laughs> and be as many people as I possibly can. So it's fun, you know. Mm -hmm. So you said you like... Um, acting and so we touched on like your favorite characters so if you have you ever thought about anything else like directing or anything like that? I have oh, okay. um, I've done some production design oh, okay so that's I guess my little stepping stone to building a resume and to moving to you know executive producing mm -hmm. I also want to touch bases on um, directing Oh. That's also something that I want to get into that I think is fun. Okay. I directed a couple of scenes for Sexy Assassin. Ooh. I did a, you know, I did my little directorial <laughs> debut. <laughs> that was fun. Mm -hmm. um, so I've done some productions, mm -hmm. um, some um, things in production, some mm -hmm. other projects I've done. So, you know, I'm, I'm a multitasker and Ooh. I want to do multiple things. I want to have a clothing line and a jewelry line. And Ooh. of course, I have my, my business that I'm very proud of that's been in the works for about nine years now. Okay. Yeah, it's finally where I wanted to be, so I'm excited. Okay, so tell me a little bit more about your business. Well, it's, <laughs> <She's> like, well. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's, um, it's homemade chocolate. I make Ooh. it at home. It's all natural, so everything that you're eating chocolate is completely ladies. all natural. <laughs> a healthy and fellas. A, a healthy indulgence that's what I call it Ooh. and um, I have two separate companies one is kid friendly mm -hmm. and the other is adult based <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, <laughs> we're not going to talk about the adult base yeah, we're we're talking about the kid that. friendly <laughs> the kid friendly um, as I said before is all natural mm -hmm. and I have another option as opposed to it just being all natural and of course a healthy indulgence I replaced the cocoa butter with coconut oil mm. and the sugar with honey so that mm. the chocolate has an added health benefit. Mm. I actually have made some for you Ooh. so that we can have some. So I'm excited about <laughs> that. <laughs> well, it's awesome. So before we go ahead and try the chocolate, which I'm very excited about, <laughs> I want to talk to you about you have children. So you, I do. Yeah, so I want you to talk a little bit about your kids. I love my babies. Mm -hmm. I have a 12-year-old that's way too big. 
<laughs> she's tall, man. Like so she's, she's gonna be modeling well. like you. She's like me when I was a kid. She is so camera shy. It's ridiculous. Like my kids are like mm -hmm. me, mm -hmm. just at different points in my life. Wow. Like it's so weird. Mm -hmm. Like my eight-year-old, she's a special needs child. Mm -hmm. I had her when she was five months, and she stopped growing a month before I had her. Oh wow! So really, she was she was premature at five months. Mm -hmm. And she's my little miracle baby. Oh, she wow. tried she tried to take me out when she got here. It didn't work. <laughs> so <laughs> she's like, I ain't going nowhere. I ain't going nowhere. So remember this: I'm not going anywhere, little girl. <laughs> So, um, she is kind of like how I am now, outgoing, outspoken, mm -hmm. and just really out there with everything. Mm -hmm. She's like my mini-me, oh. all the way, complete personality, oh. scary. And my oldest is how I used to be. Mm -hmm. She's not shy at all, but she's very camera shy. Oh. She'll get into it one day. I see it <laughs> with her little cute self. So, you being a model and, and you know, entrepreneur and everything, do you have any struggles being a single mom? <laughs> with your kids or anything like that? I mean, I knew that it would be difficult when I started, when I went for it full time, you know, because it, it puts a strain on your finances mm -hmm. and your ability to do things. Ah, oh, I got hair in my face. <laughs> it's like in my eye. And, you know, I don't have a car. You know, my transmission went out. So it kind of makes things a little difficult when it comes to auditioning and getting back and forth to filming and all that stuff because um, it's kind of hard because I can only work during school hours mm -hmm. and that makes it difficult mm -hmm. and um, Of course that adds to I guess the overall stress of doing it all and you kind of have these days I know I have these days where I'm just like oh my god mm -hmm. like my kids have what they need mm -hmm. But they don't necessarily have what they want right and it's like I feel like I'm always choosing Or having to make a decision of what I really want because I don't want to let this go But it's like the first thing I've ever really been good at mm -hmm. so I'm passionate about it mm -hmm. So I'm just like, I love acting. Mm -hmm. I love my kids. They have what they need. And later on, they'll have what they want because mommy's working hard for it now. Mm, that's beautiful. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> okay, so when we come back, we're going to get a little bit more into this story. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, can you please transfer me to Tyler, please? You love it, Tyler, don't you? You love it, say it. Tyler left early for a meeting with Dr. Hannah. He went where? Dr. Hannah. Say it. Well, before when I was talking to you, we were talking about your entrepreneurship and yes. all the things that you're into and everything and we I'll let you talk a little bit more about that because if you notice I was like oh, we'll talk about that later. <laughs> <laughs> right. So I'll let you go back over and explain to the audience what you do and we got some delicious chocolates here. Yeah. I'm so excited. I'm excited too. I've been looking at this all day. Really? <laughs> yes. I'm so greedy. It's hard not to eat your own products. But Ooh. um this is the candy from my candy shop. Ooh. This is from um, Well Well Chocolates. Well Well. And this is actually <laughs> a um, alternate option. Because the chocolate is already all natural using, you know, all natural ingredients. So it's healthy for us to eat. Mm -hmm. But this has added health benefits because I replaced the cocoa butter with coconut oil and the sugar with honey. Ooh. So it's good for your cholesterol, blood pressure, kidneys. Really? You know, because coconut oil is already good I for you. That. Mm -hmm. I live by coconut oil anyway. Mm -hmm. I get to use my product on my skin and everything. It's a multitasker. <laughs> a one-stop shop. So, you know, it has added health benefits. Mm -hmm. And I have it looking like this because it looks more authentic and it looks healthier than the other chocolate that I usually make. Because mm -hmm. everything else is in molds, special, you know, custom molds, mm -hmm. um, holiday-inspired molds, mm -hmm. you know, just candy bars. Mm -hmm. But this looks a lot more authentic and healthier. Mm -hmm. And I wanted it to look exactly how it is. Mm -hmm. So, um, I'm kind of ready to taste this. Are, are you? Yes, I am. I was waiting for you to say that. She kept picking it up and putting it in. I don't know if you noticed it, but my hands was like watching her do that. Going back and forth. I love chocolate. Like I've been cool. waiting to eat this all day. I love almonds. And I also add almonds in and shredded coconut on, re on request. So, mm. if the, if the um, customer wants just chocolate, then mm -hmm. I'll just give them just chocolate. If not, I'll add the coconuts that they want. I mean, the um, coconut, shredded coconut, mm -hmm. and the almonds that they want. Delicious. Mm. 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 And it's yep. sweet. Yeah. Are you rocking? I'm, I rock when I'm eating. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm a happy eater. I wasn't, ex I'm gonna be honest with mm. you. I wasn't expecting it to be this sweet. Mm. Really? Because you said you took out the sugar. I said she done took out the sugar. I know, but honey is also a sweetener. Yes, it is. And very delicious. Mm -hmm. And it, I'm like loving this stuff. And um, so mm -hmm. your kids must love this. They must, You must be like the mother of the year. Because yes. I know if my mama was making mama. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. They're like my little taste testers. Mm -hmm. That's how I say um, kid approved. Mm -hmm. You know when the kids like it. But my oldest daughter, she is brutally honest with me. Mm -hmm. If it doesn't taste good, she's like, Mama, this is nasty. <laughs> you know, and she'll tell me with no fear. Ew. Kids are very, very, uh, very blunt. honest. <laughs> yes, and and my youngest, you know, she has that speech impairment. So she's just like, ew. <laughs> I'm like, oh. <laughs> she's like, you know, only needs one word. Right. So I know ew. when I put this stuff or any kind of chocolate in my fridge or I store it and mm -hmm. it's gone in a week, I know it's a good batch. Okay. Cool beans. So, you said you do, um, is the well well, and what's the other one? So I do have an alternate <laughs> side to this company. It's Ooh. adult based, perfect mm -hmm. for, you know, bachelor parties, bachelorette parties, Ooh. comical gifts. It's hilarious. I've got <laughs> lots of sales of people it. just having it, just like, hey, how would you feel if you got a certain something in your box? You know, it's, it's basically, you know, just Ooh. the obvious mm -hmm. body parts and stuff mm -hmm. like that. And, um, people seem to really like it. Mm hmm. And it's, it's funny, <laughs> you know, and it's called Lusty Chocolates because I had to change the names because mm -hmm. at first they were actually called um, the Candy Shop Erotic Candy mm -hmm. for the adult side and the Candy Shop Sweet Tooth for the kid friendly side. Mm -hmm. And then when it came to marketing and thinking about the names and mm -hmm. marketing towards the schools, mm -hmm. I couldn't have a kid going home saying, hey, mom, let's get Candy Shop and the wrong Candy Shop pops up. <laughs> Oh, yeah, you don't want you that. You don't want that. So I had to change the names and make sure they weren't similar mm -hmm. so that they were researched, then the right shop would pull up. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, that is delicioso. That is Thank you. really good. <laughs> so I give her sister girl two thumbs up because this, Woo! <laughs> this, this is good. And like I said before, I wasn't expecting it to be sweet. I was mm -hmm. expecting it to be bitter. And so <laughs> I'm so happy that this... It's sweet. It's good. And it's dark chocolate. <laughs> and it's dark it's chocolate. It's dark chocolate, not milk. And it's good for you. It is. Which it's is, it's for very you. good for people like myself who have high blood pressure. So mm -hmm. I'm glad that you mentioned that. Right. Because now I could be like chomping on it and be like mm -hmm. telling my doctor in. <laughs> I had some dark chocolate and it has this in it. So I'm good. <laughs> you know, so I, I really thought about that when I did it. Because I'm health conscious. I eat well. Mm -hmm. So it would only make sense that my company is the same way. I was going to ask you, so are you very health conscious? I am. <laughs> you know, I like to take care of myself. I always okay. say this, take care of your body, your body take care of you. Mm -hmm. You know, and I mm -hmm. tell that to the kids and she goes to school talking about it. I'm like, nah, you don't have to go and badger your friends about it. <laughs> <laughs> Drink this water. <laughs> so, you know, um, we, we do eat a lot of baked foods, a lot of chicken and fish and mm -hmm. turkey. Mm -hmm. But there's so many things you can do with fish, turkey, and chicken, anything. Yeah. What, what did that one comedian say, there's a hundred and one ways to cook chicken or something? It is! We make a living off of some chicken in here, I tell you. <laughs> we love us some chicken. <laughs> well, this is, I had a pleasure talking to you. This has been by far the most fun I've had. Thank you. And I thank you for feeding me. Oh, no problem. We can finish this if you want. Yes, we're going to finish it. Because <laughs> I've been waiting on this all day. <laughs> all right, adios. Well, she's an up-and-coming actress. Yeah. Yeah. And um, entrepreneur. Mm -hmm. This business she's got going with her children. How did you... How was the candy? Well, candy was delicious. Was it? It really was. And um, it's all natural, which I thought was pretty cool. Mm -hmm. And so, despite that she is a model, a an actress, a single mom, she cooks... Her candy is really, really good. All natural. It's products. all natural. She substitutes the sugar for her honey. Mm. And she kind of, you know, she talked about what she did with it and everything, which is really good. And it tastes surprisingly good, too, because I was expecting it to be all barky or something like that. But it was good. It was actually good, yeah. you know, so. It just seems like I keep getting these gigs where I'm tasting stuff, but that was delicious. <laughs> Could have brought some back for Mama, but that's okay. That's okay. Um, the thing of it is, is that she has it for the adults as well as the children. Mm -hmm. So you know, she has, so it has special 
occasions or whatever. Yeah, so she mm -hmm. does weddings and she does um, anniversaries and parties and stuff that for the adults and then she has for the children as well so she does the baby showers and stuff like that so she kind of mm. she go you know she could do That's a little nice. bit of both That's yeah nice. I like that. <laughs> and um also see you mentioned the babies she has babies yeah she's got two beautiful young ladies mm -hmm. one's a special needs and her other daughter, but I'm gonna tell you something, her children are beautiful are they? and they're so sweet and they love their mama and their mama <laughs> love her kids. And so that's the thing I love. She just loves her girls. Mm -hmm. Her girls is like the most important thing to her. It's special. And then, that's great. Right. And her that's business. Great. So everything that she's doing, you look out for her because she mm -hmm. is going to really really make a mark on things. And she wants to become a producer? Yeah, she wants to be a producer mm -hmm. and she wants to direct movies and stuff like that. So girlfriend, she's gonna do it all. She's just not stopping at, I'm just gonna- One level, and she's, 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 she's about to blow up. So. She's growing, yeah. <laughs> and I'm looking forward to seeing her in a romantic comedy. Oh, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. I think she'll do so good with that. But it's another time it's time to say goodbye to you guys. Oh. I want you to come back. Come back. <laughs> <laughs> and Miss Katrina Howell, it has been a pleasure. I'm glad you were with us mm -hmm. this weekend. And um, we look forward to what you're be going to become. Have a great day, guys. Adios.